Do weathered boys make good pets? So a weathered boy is a neutered boy goat. These three right here are all neutered boy goats. So is that one. So is that one. So is that one. Amazing goats. Check the comments below. People will name them all for me. Ready? Name them. Gus. Thor. Billy. Way back there. And way over there. Pi. Roman. And, oh my gosh, Pi, Roman, what's the other goat's name, buddy? Thor, what's the other one's name? And Thunder, Pi, Roman, and Thunder. I just can't tell them apart. You've got one, two, three. So now these ones are all alpines. That's an alpine with the long ears. That's a La Mancha. It's another La Mancha. It's another alpine. Those are togs. Those are girls, but they're you don't neuter a girl in the goat world. You just don't do it. It's too invasive. That's the Okay. Yep, something about the bus. So this this is technically a crossbreed between an Alpine and a La Mancha. So they got half years. La Mancha's got the littles, Alpine's got the bigs, but the neutered boys are amazing. Once you neuter them at about 12 weeks, maybe even a little earlier, 10 weeks, we surgically castrate. We do not band but they become big teddy bears. Look at them. They're happy, happy boys rubbing up on me, leaning on me. They're great pets. So yes, neutered boys. I heard that. Weathered boys make great pets. You gonna go check her out? Oh, you see the dogs, huh? Now, we do disbud, but they'll still grow ooh, tiny horns, but those little horns, which we call scurs, will fall off. He's not a fan of the dog. Roman. Roman, it's fine. Is that a pumpkin? A pumpkin? Where? Right here, yellow flower. Oh, wow, we got a pumpkin in our field. I don't think this one's growing. It has a flower, it just started. Yeah, it's a pumpkin. Oh, yeah, that one's way behind. But yeah, it's got a lot of flower. I'm not, I'm moving it. It's got a lot of flower options in there a lot of flower options okay so there's your answer right there weathered boys make great pets